good, Torque fam? It's your boy Torque TV, live in the flesh. Um, I got some new wheels, but they're kind of rubbing. So I got some uh, SPL mid links I'm gonna put on the car for my boy 240 Patch. And uh, yeah, hopefully it doesn't rub. I'm gonna take you guys to the shop. I'm gonna show you us um, installing them. I'm also gonna take you to the alignment shop, American Tire on Route 22. And yeah, let's get this journey started. Alright Torque fam, so I just went to my job and I printed out the manual instructions. We got ourselves some uh, some SPL middlings here. That's what these are. Not sure if you guys know about them. We also have some uh, Swift Springs off of the Black G35 that was on the channel earlier. We are selling that car. So he gave me the springs and uh, it's uh, it's pretty good because I'm going to show you guys the rub rub, the rub a dub dub a dub 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 a rub 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 a dub. Yeah. So I don't know if you guys can see that, but yes, it's rubbing and it's rubbing bad. And these are Toyo r rs and that's expensive. We don't really need to be... Uh, messing these these tires up like that so yeah i'm just honestly gonna get straight to it leave a like comment make sure you subscribe all right torque fam so he's taking it off now um here are the wheels right here you know what i'm saying we about to get that 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 good suspension you feel me none of this tn none of this oem cup none of that you know what i'm saying they gotta go we gonna have the T in shocks, but who cares about shocks, right? All right, what's good, Torque fam? We are back here today, and unfortunately, the car is way too low. It got lower than I was uh, hoping for, lower than I expected. So I have to take these wheels off, and uh, that's just that is what it is right now in the moment, man. So uh, this is the next day, I'm jacking it up. I just went and picked up. Uh, the old wheels I have I've had on this car before. Um, you'll see. I ain't even gonna let you see it. You gonna see. All right, man. This is what we looking like right now. We looking real ugly. That's what we looking like. Real ugly, like me. You heard? Um, yeah. This just does not look right at all. Look at all this wheel gap. Tomorrow we gonna get an alignment and we gonna try to add some camber to the wheels and uh, get them wheels fitted. But I might have to just sell them because 20s are giant. Like, I wanted 18s, I wanted to stay 18, but I found a good deal on those 20s. And now it's like kicking me in the butt, you feel me? So we got a abort mission. All right, man, what's good, Torque fam? This is day three of trying to get the wheels on. Uh, they are back there. Pretty much what happened is um, a bolt got stuck in the mid link and now I'm permanently slammed until I get that issue fixed. So I had to put on these wheels as you guys just saw in the previous clips. I had to put these wheels on in the back. I still have the 20s in the front. Um, just because I was rubbing too much. So right now I'm here at American Tire and Green Book on Route 22. And um, I'm just gonna have them camber it out. That's just what we are gonna have to do. We're going to have to camber out the car until I can get some money for some smaller tires. Once I get some bread for some smaller tires, I'll then um, take the camber out and go back to my race uh, my race stance. But that's what we got to do because I cannot be driving like this. I'm not pulling up to meets like this. It's just no sad day for a Torx car. You feel me? Like, literally, this tow hook is on the ground. 
it was never near the ground. <laughs> I could fit my whole foot under there. So it definitely dropped a good like inch and a half at least. Maybe more, to be honest with you. But uh, yeah, I mean, it even lifted up my front. My front used to be on the ground. It lifted the front up. So yeah. <laughs> but y'all let me know in the comment section what you want me to do. Should I uh, put smaller tires on it and just go slam stance with speed? Or should I just go with the drag stance? I mean, this is not going to be my only car. There should be another car that's going to be on a channel purchased by me within the next year. So, let me know. But for right now, leave a like, comment, subscribe, share this video right now. And uh, obviously in the next clip, you're going to see what happens. So, yeah. You're gonna loosen up these two here, uh, your lock nuts. Are you loosening them to the to the left or to the right? These are reverse. Okay, gotcha. And then usually, typically, the other side will be the opposite. Not always, but and once those are loose, then this is your actual adjustment here. That you turn. When I tell y'all my car shoot flames, that's what I really mean. Yeah, y'all see the flames. Alright guys, we got it on, but it's still close, man. It, it is... It's extremely close. Well, here it's extremely close. Because this side is a lot lower than the other side for some reason. Well, not for some reason, but it is. That's just what it is. Hopefully, it's better, though. As you can see, he just sat in the car. And now, you can't even probably put a credit card in there. So, yeah, we'll see. Might have to take these off and throw these back on when I get home. <laughs> 